Warpugs, here we are with the spiffing Brit, who's about to teach us that Helldivers is indeed an absolutely balanced game that has no exploits at all, period, whatsoever. There is no bugs in this game at all, besides the bug bugs, who are constantly spamming on Twitter trying to get me to, you know, disregard the railgun in favor of other things. But, Warpugs, we are not falling for that. We are not going to stand up and sit down for this. It's not going to happen. We will continue to fight. We will continue to fight the robots. We will continue to fight the bugs. And get oil from their corpses. But that's not here. They're there. We're not doing this for oil. Not at all. In any case, guys, this is Spiffing Brit. <laughs> and this is the infinite grenade glitch. My god. If only I had known. Warpugs, let's get into it. <laughs> let's just go. All the Spiffing Brits links are going to be in the description down below right next to my own. Uh, check out all those Patreon merch, all that kind of stuff. Here we go. Let's go. Ooh, ooh platoon. Let's roll. Greetings, glorious citizens yes. of Super Earth. Today, the wonderful boffins at the Liberty Research Lab have done it again. We've discovered a new way for you to explosively spread democracy in a way that I'm sure the developers definitely intended. Oh, oh, there's a hell bomb, and I just hit it with a grenade. Oh, oh no. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> I love using an explosion to make an even bigger explosion. Yes. Hello there, ladies and gents. I'm the Spiffing Brit, YouTube's professional game breaker. Yes. The time has finally come. Hell Divers 2 must be investigated no. to, of course, see if it is a perfectly balanced game with no exploits, or if perhaps the developers have left in some unintended features. Hell Divers 2 is a game all about eradicating humanity's greatest threats: bugs, <laughs> mechs, and of course, other humans. Yes. We do this using <clears throat> guns, grenades, and sometimes proportionally justifiable responses. Yes. Of Everything is kept in balance with limited supplies and cooldowns on abilities. This keeps the balance of gameplay in check just as intended. And sure, outside of a few people farming currencies with cheese, it's very well balanced. Hats off to the developers, the video's over. Yay! Okay, right, I think the loyalty officer is gone. Oh okay. god, can this game be broken? <laughs> I mean, the wonderful pirate software discovered that if you turned your mech whilst firing, it just spawns the payload inside of your own hitbox, meaning you just blow up. That's incredible, developers. Yay! This. I'm gonna take it from here, I'm gonna turn right and blow myself up. Do you have any more questions? <laughs> They've had immortality glitches tied to the shield. They've had damage glitches tied to the physics engine. And you know what? The developers have actually been hard at work fixing the ball. So Yay. hats off to them. The buggy launch window is now mostly behind them. But there is one exploit they have seemingly never managed to fix. Infinite grenades. There have of course been several patches that remove this exploit. But uh -huh. like the bugs that we face on the battlefield, it somehow manages to claw its way back every time. <laughs> This exploit allows the player to exceed the 4 to 6 grenade cap and throw as many miniature explosives as they like at their enemies. But before we talk about how to use it and what it's good for, let me actually explain how this works in the current version. Okay. Welcome to a lovely bug planet. My recently recruited Helldiver and a few strangers are landing here with the intent to spread democracy. Hooray! In order to pull off this exploit, you will need only one thing. Okay. The supply pack stratagem. So without further ado, let me walk you through the steps. Step 1 is to summon and equip equip your supply pack. Step 2 is to press the key to pull out but not throw a grenade. By default for PC, this is the number 4. Right. Step 3 is to then open your stratagems menu. Step 4 is to then throw all of your grenades and just after you've thrown your last grenade, open and close your stratagem menu a few times to break the animation cycle. <laughs> Something interesting has now happened. You have a grenade in your hands but no grenades are left in your actual inventory. Oh. This interestingly allows you to still throw a grenade. And now this is not this is not an exploit. This is not a bro this is not a gang breaking glitch or anything like that. No, you see you're throwing the spirit of democracy. That's what you're throwing. We end up with minus one grenade. That's very curious. Evidently, our Helldiver here has unlocked psychic abilities and is now manifesting matter out of thin air, because even with a negative quantity of grenades, this is we're the power able of to democracy. throwing them. Now that's perfectly balanced. But how does it work? Well, from what I can tell, the game has a few checks to see if you can actually throw a grenade. If you have a grenade in your hand, then of course you can throw it. If the amount of grenades you have equals zero, then you cannot pull a grenade out Aww. to actually throw it, because there's 
there's no grenade in your inventory. But because the line of code does not say equal to or less than zero, this means that all we have to do to pull off this exploit permanently is just temporarily duck under the number zero. We can do this by performing our animation glitch of opening and closing the strategy menu. Ah. In order to fix this glitch, the developers would have simply had to say that if the amount of grenades is equal to or less than zero, then of course you can't throw a grenade. Luckily, someone forgot to do that, and we now get to be very cheesy. Yay! Let's see how effective it is with just one low level player. This is the power of democracy. And of course I die by exploding myself off of a cliff. There you but go. While I've respawned, the grenades are of course set back to default, meaning if we want to do this exploit again, we've got to go back to step one. As you could of course tell, my grenade was effective against the bugs, but we can take this even further. Let's go. The game has of course multiple grenade types, <coughs> even stun grenades, oh. which with this exploit could potentially let us stun lock hundreds of enemies. But why limit this exploit just to myself? I could double my power with friendship, so oh. I've decided to invite fellow game breakers extraordinaire pirate software to join me on this quest whilst he was having a day off from setting records on Twitch. Okay. But first, I've been told by the quartermaster that we have a surplus of grenades to hand out, so the first 17,000 people to like this video will be receiving their very own high explosive. Make sure to duck. Anyway, let's break the game. Let's do it. Oh, indeed. I don't suppose you were playing croquet this weekend with William. Oh, yes, on the lawns. Yes, me and Cecil from the club. This is why we have 4th of July. <laughs> this is the reason. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we'll, uh, we can land in, tidy up the little drop site, and then um, get ourselves ready. Oh, I spawned right on a bunch of beasties. There right, we go. Down to one grenade. I've got my supply pack on. Yeah. I'm holding the grenade in my hand. Yeah, now I have an unlimited grenades. There you there go. There we go. Look at that. Oh god. Oh god. It's okay. I'll cook one. There we go. I'll cook him too. Well, I'll cook oh. him differently. Oh, I'm, I'm cooking now. Oh, Kronos! There I we go. I introduced you to this power and you stabbed me in the back. Just what I expect from a bastard from Hampshire. I'm just over here blowing up <laughs> the terrain, you know, as we do. Good American. <laughs> Murder! Go. how you carve out the Grand Canyons. So, uh, <laughs> we have a round here to try and clear out. Because uh, we can all position yes, ourselves so. in like a prime location. Let's uh, let's stealth our way up there, I guess. You know, I feel like a lot of grenades are definitely very stealthy. Okay, mm -hmm. there's some bugs up ahead. <laughs> Everyone ready with their throwing arms? There oh, we go. That's too close. Like Jesus, yes. <laughs> Watch out! There's a lot of friendly fire potential. Yeah. Yeah, this is definitely fair and balanced. I think. Very it's fair nice and balanced. Though. It helps. It helps you with your accounting. It tells you how many you owe to the commissar afterwards. Minus 38 grenades. Yeah! Oh, we oh, closed is... the bug hole. Watch up, guys. I don't know who threw the winning grenade. It was quite hard to tell. My take. god. I, I got another one. Good job. I think I might have got one. Yep. Oh, we did it. We've done oh. it. Glorious fireworks. <laughs> uh, what oh, is the hey, actual objective? Oh, we got to pick up generator codes. Wait, there's an objective now? I, I forgot about this. Oh, okay. I thought it was all about grenades. grenades. This is how it should work, though. This is this is what we do as Americans. All right, we show up, we make a lot of noise, yes. we light everything on fire, and then we tell you that it's your fault. Yeah, and then you bill us. Yeah, and then I bill you. Yeah, I can't this is your the bugs would do this to themselves. <laughs> I can't believe it. I mean, I don't know why this is new news. All right, let's head um, let's head northwest, I guess. And let's go. Clear out this mission so we can see what the uh, the kill tally at the end looks like. Because I imagine you could you could technically. I don't know, is it a pacifist run if you clear a level without firing your gun once? There's an achievement for not firing any primaries. Yeah. I feel like this definitely makes that viable. Oh, oh my oh, god. Turn your... There's a hell bomb, oh, and I just no. hit it with a grenade. Oh, Ooh. No. Oh, god. <laughs> oh, I go. love the hell bomb. I love using an explosion to make an even bigger explosion. I'm going to walk into the live action grenade <laughs> test range. The best bit is you're going onto the grenade target range with a German, a Brit, and an American throwing grenades in your direction. And I'm not sure I which one of us I knew there was a German in this call. Oh. I made that common. <laughs> I knew there was going to be a, hit, a hidden German. <laughs> There's a charger behind um, you. you what about the charger it. behind us? Oh. Oh. Well, that was very rude, wasn't it? Oh, there was there two chargers. Oh, well, they were on fire now. I'm also on fire now. That's there good. we go. This seems normal. At least I'll die warm, you know, that's fine. You gotta look at the positives in life, okay? You really do gotta look at the positives and everything that's going on around you. 
You can't get caught up in the negatives, because if you do, you're going to miss out on so much things. So, if you're on fire, just realize, you're warm and some people are cold. Oh, the German appears to have retrieved the launch codes. Yeah. He's efficiently doing the, the objective while we're getting distracted by, by firepower. This is why every mission needs at least one German. This is exactly what I said at the start. I told you <laughs> to base your Germans, because they'd, they'd carry us through the mission. Oh, well, there's a conga liner bugs over the hill. Jeez. There's so many. Oh, oh, oh. no. I think, I think my favorite part about this still is that it shows how ineffective grenades really are. Yes. Yep. <laughs> They're, like, not very good. Ugh. At least the fire ones aren't very good. We have eight minutes to launch this bloody missile. Oh, God. Run, 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 run. Yo! I really, um, I'm appreciative of our German ally just single-handedly clutching the entire side of the world. Oh, I might yeah. I just killed him, though. <laughs> I very much just killed him. <laughs> oh, well what? done. Well done. What an unfortunate incident that we no nothing could have been done. Nothing. Absolutely nothing could have stopped that from happening. No one was at fault and you know, nothing could have been done. Unavoidable. Remember to charge him for the remember to charge him for the airstrike after this, you know. Bull casualties. What a shame. Yes. <laughs> would you like to Absolute you? shame. Absolute shame. I would. Right, and I, I will salute the missile. Oh wait, I th I don't think I'm saluting. I think I'm trying to rock, paper, scissors. Yeah, you can't have rock paper and it's well we can do it. It it's shows a paper missile. moment. Oh, I believe oh. I'm on fire. We appear to have been crispified. <laughs> we had to a difficulty mission. I think this was pretty difficult. You know, yeah. On yes. account of all the grenades. There's elements made that made difficult. this difficult. The friends we made along the way, perhaps. Yes. So while you guys are fighting this, I'm gonna put on the. <laughs> this is uh, yeah, if you it's can, all uh, up in the sky now. There you go. We celebrate. We Here we go. <laughs> wow, they really do look like fireworks. They really do. They're kind of amazing. Beautiful. Wow, look at it. It's wonderful. Hey, Cordis, you want to see something neat? Yeah. Look at this. Look at this. <laughs> oh, God. Hey, Cordis, <laughs> hey, come here. No! Cordis, come here. Kronos, please, we're so close to the finish. No! No! Oh, my God. Perfect. As it was intended. Mission complete. We did it. Yeah. Unremarkable performance. <laughs> Very oh, wait, stats. Now the, yes. Friendly fire damage. What? How did I have the most? That has to be a lie. You killed me so many times, Kronos. <laughs> oh, let's see if I can push you through this wall. Oh, well, you know what? Do Better it. Better idea. So you, you put yourself over here and try to start the rock, paper, scissors from there. Back up more. See if you can back up anymore. Oh, oh look yeah, at that. Look, it totally worked. That's, see, that's exactly yeah, yeah. what it is. Uh, Whee! Bye -bye, right, I'd like to go fight the bugs on their their planet. Okay, I'm gonna send you. I'm sending. We're sending you in, Helldiver. Sending in our best agents. <laughs> there you go. Farewell, oh, sir. No. I'll do Goodbye. my best. We. <laughs> wow, Kronos, I'm coming. I'm coming. Join <laughs> me, brother. And there we have it. Helldivers 2 is indeed a perfectly balanced game with yes. absolutely no exploits. None. As you can imagine, the recent update has added yet another grenade type, so who knows how much more powerful this has now become. I personally have been enjoying this game and strongly recommend it to others, so I hope to see some grenadiers on the front lines against humanity's foes in the near future. Yes. As always, thank you very much for watching, subscribing, and of course, a special thank you to the majestic sausages who bankroll these videos. The wonderful YouTube members and Patreons. I hope you all have a wonderful day and I'll see each and every one of you in the next one. Goodbye for now. I finally was able to drop again last night. I only got to do one mission. It's a testament to how busy I am half the time, but I got to do one mission. I was happy with that. Um, I may be able to do more in the future, but that's not likely going to happen. Um, it is the sadness. I can't figure out how to pilot the mech worth of crap. I actually look like a like a turtle that's been flipped over on its back. It is what it is. It is my ultimate sadness. There is no way for me to actually recover from it. It sucks. I'm hoping that um, my system can run Manor Lord. Because I can, like... I like a game where I can minimize it and do stuff in the background, and then when I don't have anything or I'm in the middle of waiting on something or another to happen, I can actually jump over and do something else. <sighs> I need... I need a whole bunch of stuff.
to get this stuff, to get things rolling the way I want to. I need a table two times as long, a little lever so I can slide myself down. It is what it is, War Pugs. I, I need a Tony Stark setup some days. I really do. I need four screens, two computers, one for processing, one for doing other things. I'm never going to get that. War Pugs, thank you for joining me. Be sure to leave a like and a comment, and I'll catch you guys on the next one. I want to drop badly.